Hey guys and girls, YouTube. I was uh, reading a little bit uh, about Kim Jong Il, the uh, North Korean president or dictator. I don't know what you want to call him. All this crazy shit about him. I mean, uh, and there's some crazy stuff about him. Of what, but the thing is, as I was reading about it, it kind of went to a place where they started talking about the starvation in North Korea. And then, you know, how way it leads on the way, as you read stuff, it started talking about cannibalism and people digging up bodies. And this one, two ladies, they killed their baby and ate it and all this other stuff. So it was really, like, brutal. And, uh, and one lady got caught eating bodies and stuff. And when they caught her, she was talking about how good it was. You know, like, you don't know what y'all missing, you know, it was tasty. Got to thinking. How tasty. <laughs> well, I'm shit, it's the fan, right? And this happened in uh, Russia during the end of the World War II and stuff like that. I don't remember, it was Stalingrad, I don't remember the actual town, but cannibalism was widespread. I mean, the majority of the people who survived pretty much resorted to cannibalism. And they, they was said, you know, the most scariest thing to see coming down the road was a, a well-fed man. You know, that, uh, you know what I mean? Freak you out. So... That being said, she has the fam. I'm not saying people, a lot of people, I mean, those are normal people who resort to cannibalism. I mean, you can think of some of the other experiences people has resorted to cannibalism. The ordinary people. How many meals will you miss before you start, you know, <laughs> I don't know, you know. <coughs> I mean, that's just wild, you know. And the where I'm going to, um, <laughs> um, hey, you could never say to somebody, hey, you look good. <laughs> they probably think, what do you mean? But, um, no, um, say you did resort to cannibalism, and it's like, oh my god, you know, it's like, yeah, you know, it's just the best tasting thing you ever did, like, hey, you know what I mean? And then later on, the lights come back on, and society goes back the same damn way but you ate the most amazing food in the world and it's other people's asses uh, are you going to be like laying in your bed looking at the ceiling craving man ass or something like that some swamp ass I mean if it's the greatest food I mean if it's that tasty I mean that's what people do is here try this or, or, or anything so this is a new dish or new something out there here try this it's amazing you'll love it it's the best thing ever I don't eat new stuff because I have enough thing. I'm cr I'm craving enough food, you know, fried chicken. I'm craving enough stuff with adding some more stuff to crave in there. But God forbid if that is like totally amazing stuff. <laughs> I don't know. It's just when I was reading that, I just got to thinking a little. Damn, you know what I mean? How good is it? <laughs> that was sick. Oh, I don't know, guys. It was just. I'm punchy and tired, but it just seemed weird, you know, I mean, like, I don't know, cannibalism, I mean, something goes wrong, there is, well, I mean, how many meals will people eat before people do resort to doing crazy stuff, you know, so, and uh, I don't know what talking about people say, man, it's the most dangerous game, please, you whip a gun out, you can make a person jump on the ground and do whatever you want, you know, I mean, there's certain... People out there's dangerous game, but I'd rather hunt down a guy than a tiger. Tiger sneak up on me. I can, I can hunt a clump and some dude or <laughs> it came down to it. <laughs> but I gotta say, I'm just, I don't know. It's just, that just wild me out on the stuff. Talking about how good it was. And they were dig digging up like dead off the graves and stuff. And I mean, then it's widespread in North Korea. I mean, you get hungry enough, food is food, I guess. I don't know, guys. What y'all think?